Good morning, Newman Smith. I'm Dr. Jimenez, the proud principal of Newman Smith High School, where our mission is to graduate all scholars to be college, career, or military ready without remediation. Well, welcome back. It is Wednesday, January the 12th, and here we are starting a brand new semester. And if there is any message of optimism, it is a clean slate. Hint, hint, that's also our discipline program. So I say all that to say this. Here you are, January 12th. Everyone right now is passing and no one is absence failing and we should keep it that way. And how do you do that? Just attend your classes every day, turn your work in and study. That's the purpose of school. Like, let's get, let's get that straight. If you're doing those things, you should pass your classes and you should not absence fail. So please, please know that right now, it's a great day. Everyone's starting off with a clean, clean slate. So that is something to be happy about. So in building our muscle of optimism and, posit and positivity, we are going to read a quote from former President Abraham Lincoln. Most people are about as happy as they make up their minds to be. What does that mean? Well, that means that most folks are just about as happy as they as they want to be. You can have a lot of bad things going on, and if you find a way to be uh, positive or happy or think positive thoughts, then it will make the day better and it will make the difficult situation less difficult if you can find something to be positive or optimistic about. All right. Well, um, I wanted to just give a shout out. I don't know who made the sign in the hallway, the one that says it will all be okay, but I love that sign and thank you for making it. It's a great message to send to our scholars. All right. So we do have a special guest on the news today, but before we go there, we want to get our SAT word of the day. And that word is dilemma. It's a problem usually requiring a choice between two options. So the simple sentence is the main dilemma is whether to pay for a commercial or not. Well, I can think of a couple of other ways to use the word dilemma. So we have a dilemma at Newman Smith and that dilemma is we have to make a choice in what kind of school we're going to be. Are we going to be a positive culture or are we going to be a negative culture? Well, we're going to be a positive culture. So no dilemma there. No choice, no two options. We're going to force ourselves into being a positive culture right here at Newman Smith. Okay, well, our special guest today, um, her name is Jasney, and she received a principal's coin because she has been helping our CCMR dean, Ms. Fisher, help scholars fill out the TAFSA or the FAFSA, which is a graduation requirement for all seniors this year. A big shout out for um, her. And so I wanna ask her over and she's gonna tell us about the process that she was helping our scholars with. So seniors, if you haven't started your FAFSA or TAFSA, that window is open and it is time. Last night we held an event here right at Smith. And so we wanna bring Jasney over and have her talk about filling out the FAFSA. And so here she comes. All right, Jasney. I know that a couple of years ago, about five years ago, you came to us from Venezuela. Yes. Wow. So you're not only, you're new to our country, basically. Basically. That's awesome. And so I understand that Miss Fisher asked you to come up and to fill out your FAFSA. And while doing so, you became so proficient at it, you were able to help others. Yeah. That's exciting. So I think that we only have about 100 seniors who have filled it out, and we have 504 of you that have to do it. So another 404 have to get this done to get your graduation check. So I ask this, if I haven't done it yet, how should I start? You can start to go to um, YouTube, reading the Chromebook, and you can like, go to the staff, like to the page, and I will help you out if you need help, or you can call like, Miss Villanueva or Miss Fisher, they should help too. Awesome. Okay, so if you haven't started, there is a link that we've put out there. There is a page that you can go to, seniors, and get started on your FAFSA. And if you need help, just email Miss Fisher, yes. and she will call Jasney up, and we will both get you some help. So, seniors, don't delay. You have to fill out the FAFSA because every college needs that from you to give you your student aid or if you're using Dallas County Promise, you have to fill it out. It's how you get your last dollar scholarship. So we want to make sure that all seniors begin filling out the FAFSA or the TAFSA. So seniors, turn to your neighbor and say, get started on your FAFSA. Get started on your FAFSA. Get started. Get started. All right. Well, we love you. We think you're great. 
remember character counts, and make it a great day or not, the choice is yours.